Hey, welcome back to wherever the fuck this is. We're gonna talk to Timo. Alright. This is you, Quo, because we decided that you'd do the. Oh, yeah. Oh my god, this is a long one. Oh shit, oh, that, 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 that. Ignore that viewer, please. Swear I'm not going to be. twists and turns. Ah, yeah. uh, through the wood. You. Are you wood. drinking along at home, viewers? Because yep. you should be. Timo twists and tw turns through the wood, leaves you of even more loss than you were <laughs> when you started. But you eventually arrive at an impressive looking game, overlooking the banks of a beautiful lantern lit river. I'm sure but yes, you don't have my permission to drink. Yeah. I don't think you're old enough. Yeah. I don't think you are you either. Be. Maybe. But if he is. Just uh, if just you are, just do it with apple juice. It, it's better that way. Yeah. And people who aren't Pajesh, drink responsibly. Yeah. Please. Pro probably should have said that at the beginning of every other episode, but... I think I did. I don't know. I don't yeah. remember. I was totally wasted, bro. No, I'm just kidding. Yeah. I've had, like, a single drink. Yeah. Every once in a while. Yeah. Um, I'm sure glad that you agreed to do this mission with me. Like I said, it's extremely serious and secret. Can I trust you with extremely serious secrets? Definitely not. Nah. 100% no. You know, that's the worst answer you could have possibly given. But it's a real one. I think I feel sorry for you. Call me crazy. But I'm gonna trust you with the super secret and serious mission. You ready? We're going to play a prank on Thresh. Who? What? Wondering why I need you for this? Because you're a, uh, uh, what exactly are you? Where are you from anyway? I am from the United States of America. God damn. I salute you. Uh, yeah, just wonder. I'm from the physical world. Yeah. I'm not from, uh, Japan. Oh, I've never met anyone from the before. This is going to be fun. Well, the important thing is that you're definitely not a spirit. And that means Thresh... Th yeah, Thresh's magic won't work on you. Which means you could sneak into this temple and steal his lantern for me. Oh, it's Hanzo Arrow, of course. Yeah. Yeah. I got it. Okay. What? Is Thresh too scary for you? Don't be that way. You do this and I'll be your super serious best friend. And maybe even send you back home. What do you say? I'm in. Alright. Great. I'll wait here and you go get that lantern. I would never tell him that this is the dumbest idea I've ever heard to his face. Shadow. <laughs> wait, did you click on the right one? Yeah, this is three. Wait, Marie. Oh, yeah, fuck. <laughs> right. You I return with the lantern and Timo's drops. <laughs> Timo's jaw drops in surprise. Hey. You made it back. And you brought the lantern. I thought for sure you were a goner. Nobody steals from Fresh Temple and lives to tell about it. Oh, right. I said he couldn't hurt you. Heh, <laughs> yeah. I say a lot of things, don't I? Thresh would have whipped you limb from limb. Have ye no faith? 
Yeah. I risked my life for that lantern, bro. You're right. You could have been killed. I'm so sorry. But I think you'll agree this prank was worth for putting your life in danger. Now for phase two of our prank. You wait here while I go put this plan in motion. This will just take a couple of spirit minutes. It's like five hours, right? Yeah. Wow. What a prank. You should have seen the look on Thresh's face. Yeah, dude, that was like five hours. Yeah. What's up with that? Yeah, two spirit minutes. About six months of your time. Oh, Jesus Christ. Fuck, my birthday's passed. Yeah, happy birthday, by the way. Wish me a birthday in the comments, please. Yeah. I really don't know how time works, and uh, the important thing is we just pulled a successful prank. And that means we're now super secret best friends. I could sense you're excited about this. Good. And that means you have to say the super secret best friend, best pals pledge with me. You ready? Uh, I just want to know why it's got to be secret. Why can't we be number one friends on MySpace? Yeah. I want this to be public. Yeah. I'm not doing this for some bottom barrel bitch shit. Uh... Yeah, sure, let's be pals. Yeah. Raise your hand and repeat after me. I, person from the land of death, do solemnly swear. Well, I don't swear on shit. My word's good enough. To be Timo's best pal through thick and thin. Yeah, I'll be your pal. Yeah. And to help him play the greatest prank ever on the spirit of reflection. Um, I don't know if it's the greatest prank ever, but I'll help. To help play a prank on the spirit of reflection, that guy needs to be taken down a peg. That's right. It's another prank. Save your applause. You'll need it. Luckily, we've got two people with a little magic. We could make a pretty convincing demon. And scare the bejeebies of the spirit of reflection. Just one more job. And then I'm retiring. Yes. Of course. What else would a super secret best pal do? Now, in order for this demon's disguise to work, I need you to steal one more tiny thing for me. Kindred's shadow cloak. Hey! Wait, was she cheating? Sure, it's incredibly dangerous, but probably not to you, as we both know. I'm an expert on danger. Go get that cloak, and we'll be on our way. Haha, <laughs> what was an idiot? No, we're chill. I'll just ask her for it. Yeah. Shadow cloak in hand. You return to find. Oh, yeah, no, wait, that's you. Fuck. Mm -hmm. Shadow cloak in hand, you return to find. Shadow cloak in hand, you return to find Timo expectingly. Hey, super secret best pal. Did you get the shadow cloak? Yeah, no big deal. Oh, wait, shit, that's not the right one. Same thing. Yeah. Great. Let's make a demon disguise then, shall we? We've got a magical cloak. Now we need a scary face. What? You've never been to Demon Guts before? That's so sad. <laughs> Think of it this way. The two of us... <sighs> ...are going to be stuck pretty close together for a while. Just you and me. A cloak. Who knows what could happen. But that shouldn't be a problem for two best pals, right? Two best pals, maybe more. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, no homo. Yeah. Which one? Uh, I... I mean, like, none of these are right, like. Yeah, you know. But you never cuddle with your homies before? Yeah. Like, come on, game. I'm down. Let's go. Yeah. I guess. Yeah, three. I mean, three was like. Oh, I, did, I just I just saw the first line of three and didn't read the rest. Uh, yeah. It was like, oh, yeah. Sure, I will. Of course. Yada, yada. I guess. It was basically what you were saying. I like your attitude, best pal. You keep this up, and you might even make super secret senior, best pal. And don't worry, I'll definitely send you home after this. What? Of course I will. I said so, didn't I? No, you stay still. I just need to hop on up on your shoulders. Wow, you've got a lumpy back. You should get that checked out. Don't move around so much. I'm getting on your shoulders so I can be the demon head. See? That wasn't so bad. Now we just need to put on the cloak. Stop jostling around. You're the body. You don't need to. I'll do all the seeing. See? Now we put on the mask. There we go. Now we hide in the bushes and wait for the spirit of reflection to walk by. How's it going down there, best pal? Go ahead. Say something. Nobody's around. Ah. Shh. Be quiet. He's coming. Ha 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 ha. Is it over? I can feel your balls. Oh yeah, don't Tanukis have like... Huge they ass got fucking big balls. Oh yeah. <laughs> God damn. Oh, you should have seen it best, pal. Well, what a mess took. Whoa. What a revelation. He completely thought we were a demon. You'd have to see it to believe it. It was worth it. As long as one of us got to see it, it yeah. worth it. So, yeah, one, I'm guessing, then, probably. Yeah. Or three. I mean, they're both fine. It doesn't yeah. matter. Yeah. Of course. A deal's a deal. Let me help you out of that cloak, and we'll send you home to the land of duh. <clears throat> this cloak doesn't seem to want to come off. It's magically stuck to your body. Yep, we can't send you home like this, for a whole bunch of reasons. The only way to break the magical grip of that cloak is with spirit sap. No. From a spirit tree. Wait, you want me to go get it? Don't be silly. I can't go into the spirit tree grove. Those trees hate me, but they don't know you. You'll have to get the sap yourself. Oh, right. No vision. Where have I heard that before? Just feel around over there in that grove. Trust me, you'll get sap on your hands. When you're done, just follow the sound of my voice to get back. I'll wait here singing loudly. La 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 la! Alright, I trust you, bro. Nice. Alright. Uh... You hear Timo before you see him. Uh, he has been singing. La la. To, has he been singing this entire time? La la. I mean, he's a real one. La la. La la. Oh, good. You're back. Back. Who sup? Sap all of your hands. <laughs> Yuck. Here, let me scrape some of that off. And we'll apply it to the cloak. Add a tiny bit of spirit magic. And the cloak is off. You're all back to normal. Well, I guess now's the part where I have to send you home. <laughs> I'm gonna miss you, bro. Yeah. But I gotta go. The deal's a deal. Goodbye, best pal.
just like that, you find yourself back in the real world. And still in time. Oh, wait, fuck. Wait, are we yeah. actually back? Series over. Also, yep, alright. Yeah. Series over. See you later.